The declaration signed today by the ministries of defense of Bosnia and Herzegovina, Montenegro, North Macedonia, and Serbia is a testimony to the important partnership between UNDP and these ministries in the Western Balkans. The result presented today could not have been achieved without the active cooperation among these ministries and ministers. They first signaled their commitment to gender equality and the regional character of this initiative when they signed the joint declaration in 2012. And they have remained unshaken, as we have seen today, in this promise. And for this, I would like to commend them. And one of the tangible results of these efforts is reflected in a growing number of women in the armed forces in these countries. Recent UN security resolutions dedicated to security sector reform, as well as those on women, peace, and security, reaffirm that the promotion of women's full and equal and meaningful participation in the security sector makes an important contribution to building inclusive, accountable, and legitimate institutions. Only such institutions are able to effectively protect populations and promote lasting peace and sustainable development. In other words, there is no lasting peace without development, but also no development without peace and stability. For too many women around the world and in Southeast Europe as well, violence against women is the number one security concern. Gender inequalities and power imbalances continue to represent the root causes of violence against women, and COVID-19 has only tilted the scales further. In light of this global dynamic, the efforts we are recognizing today have even more weight. Through their proactive approach, the ministries represent here today, represented here today are leading by example and paving the way for progress on the issue of gender equality more broadly. Thank you.